guys, welcome to the last module of this course, module 8, that is going to be based on language for fulfilling professional responsibilities. As we mentioned before in module A 7, uh, there are different aspects to be considered when presenting yourself to a different um, area of expertise or to other professionals as well. In this module, we're going to be focusing on how to represent the university, which is also very important. How to talk about your university in a well-described way, um, what type of characteristic it has, as well as to describe the student's abilities and the student's uh, uh, needs in a professional environment. So it is very common probably here when you have any academic committee that you can describe how the students are developing a class in both the academic level but also in the personality. So this uh, module will be giving you some ideas on vocabulary and grammar and how to do it in a more formal way. Uh, it also talks about the institutional convention, so because universities vary around the world, but we're going to be focusing on how UK universities, like the type of conventions they have, and also the differences between different institutions, which is very important as a cultural aspect, but also in the academic field, recognizing these differences and comparing towards what we have here in Colombia could be helpful for you because you can recognize the aspects that we may consider to, um, not to copy, but to adapt to our culture. And also to identify the different relationships within university settings, especially in the most formal way. So um, how to relate to other academic fields, what to say, how to say it, and how to describe um, your role as a teacher is very important as well. So during this module, you're going to be writing, but also checking some other people's work. So it is very important for you to read your assignments and to try to develop the work as much as you can. Remember to complete all the work during due date. If you have any question again, please let us know so we can just answer the questions that you have. So remember that you can go back into the videos if it is necessary and all of the aspects that you consider um, to be reviewed. So please let us know if you have any question and I hope this has been a great course and learned as much as we did with you. So please keep up the good work. Remember this is just a step but there are plenty of things that you can do to improve your own practice. Thank you very much and I hope to see your written work in it very soon.